Like Chiquita Banana, but it's... <laughs> Hi, Barbara. It's Rachel from Racine. Good morning, you've reached Racine. How can I help you? It's just frightening to see myself like this. I feel like as soon as I shave my head, every time I look in the mirror, I'm just going to see cancer. I don't know that I'm ready to see that right now. I was first diagnosed in 1994 with metastatic breast cancer. 16 and a half years, it's come back four times. It's like your hair is part of your identity and you feel like you're being erased. I can't even begin to understand why my lack of hair has made me invisible. It's just another change in my body that I don't have any control over. The whole lung looks like it's just gone. The doctors want to give you quantity of time. They know you're hurting, but when you walk out of their door, they're really not seeing the real picture. Tomorrow I am having a double mastectomy. I'm going to miss you. Mm -hmm. I got to go, babe. This I know. All right, you ready for this? I'm ready, you ready? <laughs> Not really. I recommend surrounding yourself with people who love you. Oh, you are so oh, sweet. Oh, I missed you guys. Oh, I, you. I feel cute. Yeah, <laughs> I feel alive. Most men can't get a decent wig. Frank Sinatra yeah. had a good wig, yeah. but he had a lot of money. I like having a little jiggle. <laughs> There is a beauty that can come out. That's what everybody needs to know. That's, that's what the world needs to know. Right. So we can battle this without that other fear, the beauty fear. My daughter says, keep it moving, mommy. And that's what I do. I keep it moving.